Hey, it's me, Pro Jared, and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda, a Link to the Past randomized run. I've got my second pendant, which is number two, so I got pendant two and three, but not one. I can't do one yet because I don't know where the bow is. Uh, so uh, before I do anything else, I'm going to go back and talk to these thieves, because they do give you money, but now he's going to give me... Nope, not this guy. He doesn't give me money. Some of them give you money, but I guess this guy's just like, take all my pots. There's money inside, and he looks so angry about it. Uh, so I just gotta remember where all of the, uh, all the, all the different, uh, uh, underground thieves were. Which I believe there's a couple this way. Which I should have been doing this in the first place, but I swear I just remember them being like, Take my money! In my chests or whatever, rather than actually giving you something. But that's what happens when you don't play a game for ten years. Is there one here? Is there a dude in here? I think so. I believe there was. Ah! Oh, so easy. Uh. Bam. Bam. Oh, bam. Open up. Alright, do you give me anything? Or did you just tell me to take your chests? Oh, no, he did give me a thing. It was a piece of heart. Oh, wow, I'm glad I went back for that. Would have liked it to have been a bow. But that's still useful. Was there... Oh, man, I'm sure there are other ones, and I have no idea where they are. Balls. Alright, that's fine. I got a plan, though. I got a decent amount of mini. Maybe I'm gonna go to the, uh... Okay, so it's... Alright, as a kid, I always thought this, like, little shallow puddle of water kind of looked like a bird. Like, here's its open beak. Like a sideways view of a bird. And here's its wing flapping back. And then... Right here is his little eyeball. Look! You see the bird too, right? He's a bird. <laughs> uh, that's normally a thing, but right now it's money. Uh, oh, I overshot uh, what I was trying to go to. Which is down here. Yeah. Oh, wait, shoot. I can't do the Ice Palace yet. Oh, yeah, I need the uh, upgraded gloves to get to the Ice Palace. My gloves aren't strong enough. That's right. Well, I can do this. And start throwing in some cash. Yeah. 20 rupees. And then it gives you uh, some luck that ultimately doesn't matter. Unlike in Stardew Valley, where it does. So I'm just gonna do this a couple of times and keep throwing money into this fairy until she gets so upset she gives me bombs to leave her alone. That's not actually how it goes, but might as well be. See, what's annoying is that you can only do 20 rupees at a time, but after your first upgrade, you can throw in like 100 at a time or something like that. Or 50, I don't know. One of those two. So eventually it'll speed up. But you just gotta... Keep throwing your money away until it happens. Thankfully, I've gotten plenty of money. Lots of money, lots of compasses. How much do you think compasses are worth? Can I just throw a compass in? Get a super compass that leads me to a bow? That'd be great. All right, one more time. I believe it's one more time. Right? Or is it 200 rupees? I think it's... I think it's one more time. Nah? Nee? Yeah, there we go. And she's beautiful. One of these is bombs. This one! Okay, got it right. Cool. <laughs> Alright, I'll just take that one upgrade for now. Alright, I need to... I, I, I gotta go back to the dark world. I there's nothing else I can do here at the moment. Come, bird! Uh, how about... Uh, I can't do anything here. Can't do anything in that dungeon. I could go to the forest dungeon, I guess. That might be my best bet. I do have the fire rod. I have the fire rod, so I, I can't. Yeah, I, I have the fire rod. So now, now I gotta go to dungeon three of the dark world. Already having the item there, though, just at least make it so I can get to the boss. 
because like, there's this weird skull thing, and the only way to open it up is to hit it with the fire rod, which took me ages to figure out as a kid. So I actually ended up, like, Dungeon 3 was, like, one of the last dungeons I beat because I couldn't figure out how to open up that skull face. It's your fire rod it. All right, let's head on over here. Okay. There we go. Yay! All right, welcome to Dungeon 3. This, like, whole forest is basically part of it. All right. Is there, like, there's multiple entrances and other ways to get inside, and each one is just part of the third dungeon, which I think is really cool. All right, so... Lashi will take the secret entrance. Wee. All right. Can any progress be made in here? Ah. No. Uh. That doesn't help me. All right. Uh. Boop. And ouch. Then go over. Yeah. There we go. Which, this allows me to... Oh, yeah, then you go down here, and that's where the big chest is. Okay. I can't get the big chest yet, though. It's just gonna be a compass anyway, so who gives a shit? Ooh, ooh, ooh! Ah. Useful, I guess. All right, down here. Dude, I've got this fire rod so early, I'm gonna take care of these mummies, no freaking problem. Ow. Damn it. Ah! Ah, get out of here. Well, I could use more magic. Ah! Die. Wall master. Ow. Yep, yeah, got him. Okay. Chest, chest, chest. Another key. Okay, so nothing too crazy or exciting coming from these chests thus far. But it does allow me to get through the dungeon. Me. Uh... Is there any switch in here? One of these you can cut open for a door. Nope, I think it's just a one-way passage. Okay. And then... Go around... Oh, I do have the key for this door, though. Okay. That's alright. I'm just gonna go for the chest. Ow. I swear I pressed left on the D-pad. Damn it. Ah! Vicky! Hey! Who wants a chest right away? I do! Although I, th I need to go back out and come around, though. That's fine. Ah! 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 Okay. Gonna get myself a big, big chest. Uh -huh. Damn it. Yay! Damn it. Hey. Is there anything useful in here? No. I missed. Okay, how about a... Uh... Oh, the red nail? Oh, that is awesome! This is the best armor in the game. Now I'm taking 75% less damage. That is extremely useful. Holy crap. Thank you so much. Oh my god, I'm so goddamn glad it's not a compass. Uh, dude, that's great. Now, I hope the game doesn't glitch and make it so if I find the blue mail, I go get reduced down to the blue mail. That would suck. But just having this is going to save me so much freaking headache. Oh, I'm like, I'm like elated <clears throat> just to have this armor. All right, cool. Yeah, man. And I've already got the, ow. I've already got the, uh, ow. I've already got the big uh, key. So if I want, I can just go, uh, I can go to the boss. Although I feel like I should, uh, should try to, uh, get some more chests. If there are any, I need, I would need to think of some. I mean, I know there are, just where? Ah! Damn. Ah! I need to, need all my magic for killing Gibdos. I'll push that statue over, it's fine. There we are. Were you it? 
Nope. I think I think it was like a root a wall that just had like a crap ton of those gooey vines. And that's the uh That's the one that you cut open. No, no, I That's so inconvenient. I gotta kill these Gibdos again. Look what you made me do. Your fucking hand. Ooh! Thank you very much. Hey, fuck off maybe? Alright. Wait, let me check this way first. Now that I did all that work. Who's over here? Eh? Die. Ooh, thank you. I got the key. Uh, and this was the exit. Oh, up to the left is the boss. I'm gonna check. All, I'm gonna check the other chests first, though, just to be certain. It's probably gonna end up just being the map and the uh, compass, but just on the off chance it's something I need, I, I gotta be thorough. Give me that. Okay, I got it. Nope! <sighs> I gotta go back. Okay. And, uh... Just will you get out of the way, please? Thank you. Ah, you missed. Even though I was slowly pulling a statue. Just gotta squeeze it in there. You dirty son of a bitch. Now this time, this is the one where it all works exactly how I want it. Die. And then you die again, then you die. And I get a little more magic. Then you die! I move that out of the way. I move this. Fuck you, I missed. We're in this way then. I just gotta squeeze it right into that gooch. I swear, I, 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 okay. Very generous hitboxes there. Understand now. Won't mess around. We'll uh, fully move out of the way before I try to fuck with you. I, uh, no. I almost never get hit by these wall masters normally. I swear. Basically, this entire playthrough is me defending myself and my ability to play video games. Which is, feels great. Because there's one thing I've learned from watching anyone who does Let's Plays, is that the one thing you guys care about is how good someone is at a video game. Because they're not, all you want to do is yell at them. I'm so boned here. No, please don't. Eh. You just, you just take so many hits. You know what? The hand doesn't even come down until you, all you guys are dead. Nah, I lied. I was wrong. I triggered it. Triggered. Go away. Go away. Go away. Nyeh. That's alright. I'll just... It's not like I, I've got far to go. Oh, look. I'm beginning of the dungeons right here. I have more hearts than I did before. So really, at the end of the day, I think uh, I'm doing all right. I missed. Try again. Yay, that saved me like four frames. Speedrun tactics right there. Throw the boomerang, get items, save frames. Ow. Ah! Okay. All right, I've got enough for two shots. Two shots to kill Gibdos with. In this fucking hand! Fuck you. I'm just, I'm just so angry. Okay. Nope. Now my sword's going through you. Ah! This, ah, I got it. I'm three, I'm four, ha, ha, ha. I swear to God. I just did so much work. For what? For what? Compass. Hmm, I should have known. Alright, I'm a bunny rabbit. Think I'm done here. 
Uh... Is there, was there anything over here? Is it a key? Oh, full magic. I'll take full magic. Alright. Eh. Eh. Was you a thing? No. Alright. Uh, I never got the map, did I? I've, like, been all to all the rooms. Was that... Is that normally the map? I don't know. Okay, well, I'm just gonna go over to the actual boss area now, because... Pretty sure I did everything here. Pretty sure I'm not gonna miss a map. I don't like these guys, though. Alright. See, it's got this weird, like, gross centipede thing. Ah! Oh! No, you just look like a gross, noseless monster. Alright, nothing in here. Alright. Okay. Alright, there's a chest. Die. Saving my magic towards the potential boss. Uh, I have the key already. But I don't have that chest. Other side. Remembering this wrong? Oh no, it was that way. Okay. And then, and then the chest is down below, but up here is a shortcut of sorts to get to that chest. Bonk. This is gonna save my magic, gonna save my magic so I can get. There's the map. Okay. I believe that's. Ah! I believe that's everything now. Go away. Go away, everyone. Okay. Doing great. Doing great. Shit. No. Just get in there. God damn. Okay. Up into here. Open this key door. This is not what I'm really curious about with this boss. Is that I can just continue using the fire rod on him. But I also have bombos? And I wonder if Bombos will just do more damage. That's not the one I want to press. Like, I, I generally don't remember or know, like, the damage statistics of Bombos versus the Fire Rod. Oh, this is the one we gotta hit all the... This is where you hit all the lamps. And then it opens up. Alright, I'm gonna try to save some magic by using my lamp. Even though I don't think it'll work. A quick switch to fire run. Oh, I did it! Nice. This is where you cut open the uh, the vines for the door. Damn it! I'm a rabbit. Bunny link, bunny. Nee. Let's get rid of the uh, those squigglers here. Damn it. Got you. Why did I kill everyone? I didn't need to do that. There we are. No, oh, this is where. Kill everyone. I missed. Yee! There it is. Eh. Well, Freaking tiny hard headed puppy. Die. 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 I know it hurts. There. Give me that. I needed that. And right, then you drop down here for the boss. I'm gonna. Five arrows. Okay. Well. I don't know if Bombos is a good idea or not, but hello, moth. Try. Take this. Ah! I don't know if this is a good idea or not, but take it. Yeah. That might have done absolutely nothing. Strong chance of that. Yeah. Ah, eh. oh, shit, I'm too low on magic. Uh, do I have enough magic for this? Damn it. 
I can, like, use the lamp again. That's it. Okay. It's this regular-ass sword, then. That's all I got. Eh. Eh. Cool. Eh. Eh. This is... I hate this boss. There's just spikes moving everywhere, and the floor goes everywhere. Dude, I'd be so dead if I didn't have the freaking red mail. Oh my god. I'm gonna die. I should have used my magic wisely! Alright. Gonna need some magic to beat him. Because the fire rod just does a, so much damage against bosses. Um, I don't even know if I can get enough magic. I might have to like, leave, come back with a blue potion or something. Oh, eh, yay. These guys don't really drop anything now. Oh, fucking A. Uh, I, I'm fuck, fuck, I missed. Shit. Yeah, I only get like two shots out of it. I can't improve my magic power until what did I need? Was it the uh the, the black gloves? I think. No, it was the magic powder. I don't have the goddamn magic powder yet. Okay, I, I gotta. I have to. I need to come back with magic. Until I have magic, I'm, I can't do shit in this dungeon. Taking out the Gibdos and using my fire rod that much is too taxing. Maybe I can find a. So it was in here. What was this? Worthless. Okay. Was this, there's a. This guy's got some magic up in here that I don't know about. No. Die. Uh. Whoop. And, uh... Well, he's the exit over here. Wait, I never went in there? Shit, I never went in there. Fuck, what's in there? Oh, fuck, what if it's something important? I don't have a key, though. Do one of you guys drop a key? Fuck. Oh, I hope he didn't have a key. That was really important. Oh, fuck. Shit, man. I'm really concerned about that now. Did I just, like, completely screw myself? Until I find another key to get back into there? No. This has got to be another key somewhere, right? Oh, man. Dude, I don't know. Oh man, it's kind of disheartening. Cause I have, I entirely have no idea. I don't remember. I don't remember. Well, what was this house? Uh, you don't have a blue potion. That's not gonna help me. I need a blue potion. Dang it. If anyone knows where I can get another key, that might be useful if we're back there. How are there still bees in the dark world? That's so shitty. Uh, is there anything this way? Ouch. Uh, not especially, I don't think. I think it's like just cut through the forest. No, there's there's there ain't nothing this way. I'm just going back through. Hmm. I mean, I, I guess I could attempt the boss again, but I need I need I need magic. All right. I'm just gonna go back to the light world. I'm gonna go back to the light world, buy some potions to get all my magic stuck, magic up and whatnot. Then I'll return here, beat this boss, 
and then we can move on. And then, uh, whatever item was behind that locked door, it's gone forever, I guess. Because I don't know how else I'm going to get into that. I don't know. Alright, oh, we'll come back after I get myself rejuvenated and ready to fight that boss. We'll do it that way. So, that said, as always, thank you guys so very much for watching. See you next time! Welcome back to another Let's Play of The Legend of Zelda for Wii U. So, there are a couple things I wanted to show you that I didn't do. Yes, I will adopt this cat. Dudley? Zessia Rich Deputy Mist? No, look at that. That is an orange cat. This cat's name is Ares, just like my actual cat.